Welcome back to Bulldogs Franchise on Madden 20. This is Extinguisher 10, and today we are taking on the 3-0 Los Angeles Chargers. Los Angeles? San Diego. New Orleans. Las Vegas? I don't know. Chargers, they're all over the place. Anyway, we uh, last week we barely squeaked out a win versus the Dallas Cowboys. It was a great, great game, game and a ton of fun. But you know what? Let's jump right into our next game. The Chargers, an 81 overall versus the Bulldogs, 72 overall. Let's get after it. And look at that. Deshaun Watson is a San Diego Charger. That is going to make this game a little more difficult. And he is on fire. 7-0, and or 7 touchdowns versus 0 interceptions. Let's get after it. These Chargers have some serious weapons, but we got to take some of them away. Ooh, kind of went for the interception. Didn't really work out. Deshaun Watson, two for two. 19 yards. Dope! And taken down for the sack, David Byram. There we go. Finally getting a third and six. Let's see if we can stop these guys before midfield. Manning up on Hunter Henry. That seems like a... Oh, come on, somebody! Didn't get the interception, but we are stopping them. It's a fourth and six. Let's get the ball back. And here we are, our Bulldogs starting offense coming out, led by Blair McDaniel. He's had a bit of a rocky first, uh, first part of his rookie season, but overall, not bad. Definitely an improvement over Seth Smith. Second 12. Oh, I do not. Yes, right there. Kalen Brock, open. Not for the first down, but at least getting us a little closer. Third and six. Right there. Yes, he got it to Pearson Amtrim quick enough. All right, two for two, 25 yards, and we have ourselves a first down. Second and 10. Run like the wind, bullseye. What? Oh, juked a man out. There we go. Let's go. Let's go. Tron Beckham weaving through traffic for his first touchdown of the game. Let's go. Let's do it. 20th career rushing touchdown for the uh, original Bulldog. Oh, no. Uh -huh. <laughs> I haven't played this in. God, it's probably been a month. I have not been playing this for a while with MLB The Show coming out, and my timing is way off. Got to get it back. At least we're up by six. And back on defense. Oh, my. Oh, my. Come on. Oh, ball's on the ground. Ball's on the ground. Oh, <laughs> picked up by Santiago. Second and ten after that forced fumble, but they recovered. And taken down for the sack once again. Greg Tomlinson with his first sack of the game. Deshaun Watson doesn't know what to do with this pressure. Third and 21. What are the Chargers going to do? I'm pretty sure they're going to pass it and swat it away. Okay. We'll take it. We're getting the ball back. Third and five. Got him right there. Pearson Antrim. Oh, with the juke. Getting an extra couple yards. Blair McDaniel. Three for three so far. The ground gain's not working, so we're going to go right back to the pass. Right there, just a little few extra yards. Pearson getting the first down when it didn't look like that was going to happen. Third and seven. Let's not turn it over. I want to make sure I at least get a field goal and make it a two-score game. Right there, over the middle. Yes! Kevin Durant! Oh, he put the ball on the ground! No! No, Desmond King picks it up. It's a turnover, and that's really disappointing. But we're on the three. Let's see if we can get a safety here. Oh, God. He got jacked up. Third and five. And, Wait, oh, don't oh, pick it off. <laughs> he almost swatted it and intercepted it himself. Uh, but we're getting the ball back. Feels like this is a pointless attempt because they are just really holding us on the ground game, but... It's the best part of our offense, generally speaking. So we got to keep going and three yards. I was okay, but sadly, probably our best gain so far. Second and seven. What are we going to do? He is open up the field. Oh, he threw it short and oh, we got lucky. That was triple coverage, but he passed them all. I just didn't get it deep enough. 
I threw it, darn fly, <laughs> threw that um, on the run, so that's not good. Gotta keep the drive going. Right? Oh, had a man, but pressure came in too quick with the cornerback blitz. And we are having a punt. Ooh, that was not my best punt, but there we go. <laughs> yes, down to the five. Not, not my best work, but not bad either. Get in the backfield. No, oh, no. David Byram, you're not fast enough. Somebody who's faster. Kadero Hogan, you've got more speed. And it's just not going to work. Melvin <laughs> Gordon with the 95-yard touchdown. And barring the extra point, we are going to be down by one. And that missed extra point is really coming back to haunt us. We're down by one. I'm going to the empty backfield. The running game is not working for us. So let's, let's open it up and let's get it. Right there over the top. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, just overthrew him. Second and 10. I need, I've got him over the top. Come on. Oh, ow. almost at Alex Hale. Blair McDaniel is overthrowing guys. I guess it's better than throwing interceptions, but come on. That's the second touchdown that he's missed. Third and 10. One a first down, one a first down and Oh, Josh Hoffman, come on. <laughs> You're not running it forward for the first down. And fourth and 21, what do you think we should do? And taken down. Is that Levi Steed? Yes, it is with his first sack of the game. That's right, young fella. Get your jumping jacks. 15 sacks on the season. Taking the Chargers out of field goal range and out of their shot to get anything out of this drive. Let's get this ball back, let's score. Third and five. Shoot. There was guys marginally open, but I just couldn't pull the trigger and Joey Bosa made me pay for my hesitation. Oh yes, Levi Steed, what a man. Taking him down for a second time. And he is in the zone, let's go. Levi Steed in the zone. What can you do for us, buddy? What can you do? Oh, and that's the first down, isn't it? Yes, it is. Second and 11. What are you gonna do, Chargers? What are you gonna do? And you're gonna go down. That's what you're gonna do. Levi Steed with another sack. His third sack of the half. Dope. Kick is up and through. We are down by four, 51 seconds left. We have all our timeouts. First and 10, let's get some points. Got him over the top. Come on. Yes, Roy Rutledge with the reception. Yeah, baby. Come on, snap it. Right, oh, right there. Alex Hale with the reception, let's call timeout. I froze, there was too many guys open. Seven seconds left. We're either going to the end zone or getting the first and calling a quick timeout. Just call that quick timeout so we can get the field goal. Oh, get out of bounds. Get out of bounds. Jesus. Let's call the timeout anyway, <laughs> even though we didn't need to. Woo. All right. We're in field goal range. Let's just get the points. Oh, no. Did I miss another one? Woo. <laughs> Thankfully, Becca Longo is much better than I am. And we got through. We're only down by one going into the half and we get the ball to start the half off. Let's do this. Oh, oh yeah, baby. They have everybody on that side of the field. I just need to get past a linebacker. Can we run faster than him? What? Yes, we can. And, oh, didn't quite get the block blocking quick enough, but finally, wow, 85 yards. I must've forgot some long yard cause I don't, young, long yard, what? Some long run because I don't remember him having that kind of yardage. Okay, let's l run right into the lion's den. Let's go. And oh, that's why I wasn't running there. Stupid. Huh. Third and one. We really need this stop. Uh oh. It's a pass. But taken down by Tay Wiley. The man with limited playing time finally gets on the field and he gets himself a sack. And we were holding the Chargers to a field goal. 
that is as much as they were driving down field. That is a huge win. We're only down by four. Let's see if we can get ourselves a touchdown. Second, 17. And right there. Boing! Oh, that was not who was supposed to catch that, but I'll take it. Woo! Kevin Durant just uh, being too tall for uh, the other guy. Didn't notice who that was, but too tall for the other guy to catch it. Third and four. We've got... Come on, Alex. Come on, Alex. Wait. No, he couldn't hold on. There were so many guys who were a little open, and I just had to choose one. No one was wide open. There you go, Levi Steed with his fourth sack of the game. He is a monster. He is insane. He is the greatest of all time. And they have to punt. Second and ten. And got a man right there. Yes, Trey Griffey with the reception. And okay, we have a charger down. That's all right. That is all right. Third and ten. Right there. Right there. Yes. Uh, Court Haynes. Haynes. What was his name again? <laughs> we drafted him in the third or fourth. Anyway, the rookie with the reception. Carlos McBath checking in for the first time today. And just don't get... There you go. Good run by the rookie. Ten yards, just shy of the first. And going into the fourth quarter, we are down by four. But we're marching downfield. Let's score right now. Preferably, let's get the touchdown. First and ten. Oh, yes! Pearson Antrim, one more touchdown to add to his career totals. He is the man. He is the greatest receiver on this team. And we finally have taken a lead, lead since the first quarter. Since the first score of the game. We are nearly holding on to a three point lead and we are taking uh, Deshaun Watson down with a fifth sack of the game by Levi Steed who is still in this zone and now we have a third and 13 and Deshaun Watson going down again was that Greg Tomlinson no that was David Byram and we are getting the ball back let's play some keep away what you got here Richard whoa run away run away run away and another handoff to Teron Beckham. Oh, get off him. Got the first down. Probably could have got more, but he kind of stuck to the side of the offensive lineman. Second and 11. No, throw it away. It's too late. Nobody was open. Nobody. And Joey Post is in the zone. No! All right, let's double up the protection over there. Let's see what we can do. Over the top, over the top. Oh. Just couldn't do it. They had a spy on me. We're not going to shy away from our aggressive defense. We're going to be sending some serious heat. Like usual. And. Okay, bat it away. All right. We're going to live and die by the blitz. Third and four. Stop right here. Maybe almost shores up the game. And we get the stop. Are they going to go for it? And they are not, we are getting the ball there, punting it away. Hopefully it's not a fake. All right. And we'll just uh, let that bounce over here. Go to the 20 and run the ball some more. And we need five more yards to get Joey Bosa out of the zone. Let's see if we can get it right here. And yes, we did. Uh -uh. And he bro another broken tackle, nice. Teron Beckham, what a freaking monster. All right, Teron. We need this first down. We need it pretty bad. Yes, you got it. There we go. Let's get McBath back here in the game. A little motion. Apparently the corner knows exactly where he's going. Oh, McBath almost getting the first down on that one run. Nice. He's having a good game. And why not? Let's give Becca Longo a shot at a 55-yard field goal. Oof there but it looks like it's gonna make it through and we get it yes 55 yards a career long for Becca Longo that was nothing you'd want to do in a regular game but hey it's a video game so we're gonna tack on just a little bit we squeak our way get a nice little comeback there for the victory Deshaun Watson was 
passing very well. He didn't break out of the pocket and do any of that crazy stuff that he normally does in real life. But that was just a good, solid game. The defense was solid. The offense was, uh, it was, uh, it could have been better. They got two takeaways, and we still actually outplayed them. Somehow, even though it was 5.7 yards per play versus their 5.5, but hey, who cares? There goes Nick Montana. I forgot he was even on the team. Let's check out the stats. And Blair McDaniel just had a nice, solid game managing game. 99.5 quarterback rating, 13 completions on 23 attempts, 198 yards, 56% completion co completion percentage. Woo! Uh, one touchdown, no interceptions. Tron Beckham, 132 yards on 20 attempts, 6.6 .6 yards per carry. I think a lot of that was on the back end and one long run in the first half. But got a touchdown, did fumble it once, broken tackle. That was a beastly run. Richard Franklin, three rushes, four yards. Carlos, McBla Carlos McBath, <laughs> two attempts, but 17 yards. Very, very uh, taking advantage of his, his limited touches. And then Pearson and Antrim leading the team, both with four receptions and 65 yards. And the only touchdown drops by Alex Hale and David Byram. David Byram um, must have been a dropped interception. And Joey Bosa was just a royal pain. Josh Hoffman gave up two. Oh, wait, Josh Hoffman gave up two. Oh, that's right. There was a cornerback blitz, and I don't remember the other one coming from that side, but D'Angelo Dunn and Clinton Portis, sorry, Connor Portis. Wrong, wrong Portis. Um, shout out to the old running back for the Broncos and the Redskins. But Connor Portis and D'Angelo Dunn had a tough time handling Nick Bosa. But on defense... Tackles led by Levi Steed and Sylvester James, the rookie. Tackles for loss, quite a few guys with one, nobody with more than one. Sacks, five by Levi Steed, two by David Byram, and one by Greg Timlinson and Tay Wiley. No interceptions. And I don't believe any forced fumbles. Oh yes, one forced fumble by David Byram, but I don't think we recovered it. No, we didn't. And I'll see you back in the menu. And back here in the menu, we've got some upgrades. Josh Hoffman, our original Bulldog, one of our very first draft picks. We're going to go into Pass Protector because we definitely need some help there. And up to an 82 overall, one to strength. Nice. Greg Tomlinson again with another upgrade. We drafted, drafted him as a 70 overall. He's up to a 75. Now a 76 overall. And we're only like halfway through his rookie season and quite a few different things. Strength, that's nice. I'd like to see speed, but that's a lot more rare. One to finesse moves, one to man, one to zone. Love all those. Cecil Leonard getting another upgrade. Let's go into pass coverage because that's our archetype. Two to zone, nice. And Trey Griffey, another original Bulldog. Let's go into deep threat because that is the archetype. One to release, two to deep route running, one to catching, one to catch in traffic. Love it all, love it. And we have advanced the week. And it looks like we have two, two breakout player notices. I can't wait to see who they are and see if we can upgrade both of these guys, if not just one, but hopefully both. And I am just really excited, having a blast with this series. Looks like we got a weekly award. Let's check that out. And it is Levi Steed. Oh, of course it's Levi Steed. Five sacks, seven tackles. That'll do that. But you know what else that'll do? That'll do it for this episode of... I almost said the legend of Bob Johnson, even though I haven't played that series in like two years. But that'll do it for Bulldogs franchise on Madden 20. This is Extinguisher 10 signing out. Have a great rest of your day.